Alright guys, so I make a quick video of here uh, since I had to move across the hall into this new room. So I'll just uh, make a quick video here about my new room setup. Okay, so I guess we'll start with my bed area first. We got my Lil Buster's bed sheet here on top of my bed with my Lote No Mocha hug pillow along with these giant wall scrolls that are like five feet tall or something like that. They're pretty they're pretty big. Come over here, got a Guitar Freaks V4 arch from Japan which comes uh, with the upgrade kits for the arcade machines. Come over here, got my Dance Dance Revolution Extreme marquee that goes normally on top of the arcade machine. Um, got my iPhone, iPad, uh, Dance Dance Revolution Party Collection bucket. And we'll come over here, got my Drummania V3 uh, arch stand, which also uh, comes only with the uh, upgrade kits for the game, the arcade game. So we got that, it's going to be kind of hard to see up there, but yeah. Got a 2DX Empress poster, more Halo posters right here. Halo stuff again, because I love Halo. Come down here. Got a ton of Xbox 360 games, like, like literally just a ton. Got all my like music games and stuff over here. And it goes way up there. Like I, I can't even play any more games up there because it's literally hitting it. So, yeah, uh, Halo Reach in the way here, but those are our games right there. Come down here. Got more Xbox 360 games, but they're all my Japanese titles. And one one Wii game. All right, I have quite the collection for that. PS3 games, all my 2DX games. The Empress right there. DJ Troopers Gold. Some other ones. Taiko no Tatsujin, Gran Turismo 4. The Japanese version, by the way, which came with my console. Some GameCube games. Uh, original Xbox games. PlayStation 2 games. We come down here. Got my PSP games down here, which are all from Asia. We got Pump It Up, DJ Max Portable 2, and Techno Tatsujin Portable 2. Got all my PlayStation games from Japan here. We got even one that's new and sealed, which is uh, Pen Gata Mix, B Mania. Single Japanese Dreamcast game, Japanese uh, Nintendo DS game, Wonder Swan game. Uh, some more PlayStation games, a few Dreamcast games on the end here, and some CDs right there. Now let's get up here. Got a Beatmania 5th Mix marquee hanging on my door. Got a thing with uh, all my EMU's cards right here. Come over here. Got my whiteboard with my current Dance Dance Revolution AAA account. Some ECC information and random stuff I need to take care of hanging from the board. Some Xbox 360 boxes. Then we come over here. Got more anime posters and other stuff. Got anime DVDs. Drumania Tough Mix Marquee, which if it if you can't tell, they give away it's food like because there's white space up there and normal ones don't have that. There's no Konami sticker, which is also the giveaway. Some Xbox 360 controllers, Final Fantasy 13 faceplate, some books over there, Wonder Swan thing back there, some um, armbands that came with some of my games. Konami sent me those Dance Dance Revolution ones, so that was pretty awesome. It happened about, I don't know, five years ago or something like that. Got Guitar Freaks and Drummania, that's actually a towel but uh, I just use it as a poster. I don't know what you would really use the towel for. I guess it's for wiping your hands when you play Drumania with all the sweat. But get some more uh, game posters here. Gears of War 3, Flag, Halo 3 poster, Modern Warfare 2 poster. Then we finally get over to my desk here and there's a lot of stuff on my desk obviously. So I guess we'll start up here. Uh, TX Gold poster, TX DJ Troopers poster, Pop and Music 14 poster. I'm not even a fan of Pop and Music. I have a Pop and Music poster. Got a 
drum on oh no, a Guitar Freaks 11th mix. Uh, these are all like little brochures to advertise a game. Guitar Freaks and Drummania V, Drummania V2, Guitar Freaks V3, TX Happy Sky, GX Gold. We got a shuffle poster back there. Uh, Shiki uh, mini little poster here. Technica 2 ad that they give away at like conventions and stuff. And then my friend got me this from the Konami style store in Japan. I'm not really sure what it is, but it's pretty cool and it's CDX related, so I happened to end up on my wall. And then we got my computer here, which uh, runs straight to this screen here. This is a brand new monitor, by the way. I got my 5.1 uh, surround sound going all over the place here. And this is where I play all my games, and then got my mouse pad. So if I wanted to like change the input or anything here, you can see it will connect to my Xbox. So yeah, and we got my all my consoles down on the bottom here. Got my Japanese PlayStation 2 on top right here. Got my. Uh, a broken Xbox 360. It doesn't even have the eject base on it, which I, I think is uh, really, really funny, but kind of like keep it here to make it look kind of cool and uh, give me an excuse to put that faceplate on an Xbox. Uh, the Death Smiles faceplate. Got my American Xbox, which is the one that's turned on. And then always to the right, we got my uh, Japanese Xbox 360 and uh, the R2 faceplates, the one on my Japanese one. That is a developer's faceplate. It is the UK launch team faceplate from 2005, I believe. Then we got my es Escaluda faceplate because uh, I love playing uh, shmups to like Dance Revolution and stuff. So I had to get the collector's edition of that game. Then we come up here, and you might be wondering what this is. Is this monitor? It's actually connected to something. It's not connected to this computer down here. It's actually connected to a computer in my closet, which um, has uh, well all of my extra information. But I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it, but it's right down there. And I I just made this uh, yesterday. This computer. It's pretty much a server for me to store more information on, because I have like too many videos and stuff to be able to store onto just a single hard drive. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much my room. Um, yeah, it's <laughs> my room is pretty nuts. Uh, I probably look like a huge nerd in this video, but you know, it's probably because I am. But yeah, hard to be bored in my room like ever. There's always something you can be doing for fun. So yeah. Thanks for watching guys, maybe I'll throw up some uh, other random life related videos, but this is it for now, thanks for watching.